Well, hello there. Yet again, this is John Anthony Francis Wilcox, and today is Saturday, the 18th of June, 2022. So tomorrow is Father's Day, and it is also my dad's, well, what would have been his 95th birthday. Wow. In five years, he'd have been 100. He used to tell me I'd love to live to be a hundred, and you know what? I would have loved for him to be a hundred, you know. But uh, you know, he lived to be eighty-seven. That's still pretty darn good. So I should be so lucky, you know. Uh, I certainly hope so. So today, Saturday, um, was very nice. I got a visit from my nephew Timmy and his wife and his two sons. Kieran and Carter, so they had a nice visit, uh, dropped by, brought me some stuff, sat, talked about things. It's nice, you know, it's nice when one of the nephews or that, nephews or nieces or whoever, thinks enough about me to come visit me. Um, I know also, I believe it's tomorrow, my niece Tracy's supposed to pop by, so that'll be good. <coughs> It's nice to know that, you know, to some people I'm worth the effort. To others, uh, I guess I'd say less so. Uh, I don't know. Um, as for the week, it's been a week of not getting done as much as, nearly as much as I was hoping to get done. Because it just didn't feel good all week. A lot of stomach problems, a lot of hand and uh, back issues so and uh, and other issues back issues not back issues like a comic well, I said I, my back was bothering me my hand quite a bit this you know I have that what they call Dupuytren's contracture and it's kind of pulls your hand in you know it sucks so saw two great movies yesterday two old movies one from I believe 64 a British film called the Earth Dies Screaming. And it was about um, these alien robots that came and killed off a lot of the Earth. And uh, these people have to find a way to survive. It was a short film, just over an hour, but it was it was really good. I recognized a lot of the faces from a lot of like Hammer and Amicus stuff. You know, a lot of uh, your standard British cast. Plus a couple of them I remember seeing in like the Steed of Mrs. Peel and Steed and Tara King Avengers. So that was cool. And I watched one called... What the heck was that? It was an Italian film. The Big Something or Other. It was... Whatever it was. I'll, I'll think of it. And when I do, you watch out. But um, anyway, it was um, an Italian film about basically like a cop versus the mob. And it was, I'd never seen this thing. It was from the mid 70s. It was violent as all hell. It had a great guest appearance from Vincent Gardenia, who, you know, from a bunch of stuff, including, I think he's in a couple of Death Wish films. And um, brutal. Just a brutal film. Um, and I can't for the life of me think... You know what the problem is? Is it's such a simple title. Like the big heist or the big... But it wasn't a heist. It was whatever it was. Um, I'll, I'll let you know next week. Or you know what? Watch the end credits here. I'll find out what it was and I'll put it at the end. Okay? I'll put a... a like a promo poster or the front cover of the Blu-ray or whatever. But um, for it sounds weird to say, for for the film that I can't remember the title, I really highly recommend this thing. If you like, like explosive cop-on-mob action in, with an Italian twist and a frustrated hero and uh, lots of interesting twists and turns in it. Uh, so really enjoyed that. Um, did some art, uh, wrote a poem, been working on a piece of music that um, I am calling Sun Shower. It's going to be a keyboard-based piece, 
piece or pieced. It's a new mouth. It's the same old mouth. That's the problem. And uh, have I done much else other than that? Certainly haven't slept a lot. Does it show? Oh. <laughs> Heard from a few friends. A little bit of this and that, you know, some stuff, some things. Um, got in my two CD remaster of Gong's Angel's Egg album, which is a wonderful album. Um, uh, from in fact from the Gong Appreciation Society themselves over in Glastonbury in England so I gave that a listen that was wonderful today I needed to get calm to be centered so I listened to uh, as always uh, one of my go-to's for that is Kate Bush's Lionheart album which is such a splendid album I hope you know that album and listen to it if not do it. I mean, except for my friend Larry. He doesn't. He's, he, Kate Bush is no bueno for for Larry, and I understand that. We all have our our different things. But uh, anyway, that's been pretty much it. I didn't do any big cooking projects, nothing like that. We'll see what the week brings. So I hope you're all doing well. I love you all. Be well. Take care. See you next week. Bye bye.